One of the most interesting things about developing an audience online is the fact that brands are actually starting to send me products to review. One of those products is the Watersong Hand Shower, which uh, retails for around $39.95. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to install it, which is pretty easy, and how it operates. So let's get into it. Hi there, I'm Dave with Remodel Media, and for the last 16 years, I've helped people put together kitchens, baths, outdoor kitchens, and various other home renovation projects. My mission in life is to eliminate regret, and I do that by bringing people the latest tips, tricks, and products for their home remodel. So if you're new here, consider subscribing and ring that bell for notifications so you never miss an episode. So step one in installing your hand shower is going to be removing the old shower head. Now you probably have a shower arm that looks like this and that shower head can usually be removed through a simple counterclockwise or lefty loosey kind of motion. Now the one thing that the water song hand shower does not come with is a shower arm mount. Now there's a couple different ways to mount a hand shower. You can mount a hand shower on a sliding bar, you can mount a hand shower on a hook, or you can mount a hand shower on your shower arm. This is your most typical retrofit scenario and probably your most common installation and that's what we're going to be doing today. So you will need to pick up for around $10 or less a simple shower arm mount. Once you've picked that up, the water song shower head comes with a shower head, shower hose, and a couple of rubber washers. Now you'll notice that the shower hose actually has two ends. One end looks like a hexagonal nut and the other end is more cone shaped. The cone shaped side of the hose is what's going to attach to your hand shower. Reason being is this is the part that's going to set in the cradle once you dock your hand shower on the shower arm. The hexagonal nut goes where the water outlet is. So that's where your water supply is. I've seen a number of installations, including those done by licensed professionals, where the hand shower hose was reversed. It's a simple solution if you mess it up. They're both a half inch threaded connection, righty tighty, lefty loosey. So once you've got all your connections hand tight, that's about all you should need to do because everything comes with a rubber washer. You're not going to need to do much else. Uh, hand tight should be sufficient. If you do need to use tools, you know, I recommend a pair of groove joint pliers, uh, wrap the teeth in electrical tape, and you can give it an extra twist if you feel more comfortable that way. Now comes the test. Here we go. Now you can see here that the Water Song hand shower actually has three spray settings using an easy push button toggle. So no more having to grab and twist the face of a shower head to try and get it to click and change. It's a simple one button push. And the three settings are uh, a wide rain spray, a regular standard shower head spray, and what my wife would refer to as the get the soap out of my hair spray, uh, sort of a massage or a center pulsating setting. You'll notice the nozzles on the spray face are rubberized silicone. What this is gonna do is it's gonna give you a little easier cleanup when it comes to calcium, magnesium, mineral buildup, things like that. And what that means to you is all you have to do is rub your hand over the edge of the spray face and you're going to flick away the calcium buildup. Thanks for watching. I hope you got some good information out of that episode. Go ahead and click here for more videos. Go ahead and click here to subscribe and make sure you check out the description below for relevant links to some of the products that we discussed today and leave your comments and questions down below because I love answering them. As always, I'll see you in the next one.